Naruto, God Level System Author, Blue Water God. Chapter 186 The Final Hole Card The Golden Wheel is Reborn. Rixianchen shouted softly. The dazzling golden blade slashed through, and it was originally awesome, but it cut off the six paths of the great wooden Dan Buddha, Suzu, and was cut in half by the golden sword light. Although Lidao Suzu was cut in half, Otsatsuki Yu had a happy face, because the space blockade was finally broken, and it was still cut open by Rixianchen's golden cycle life explosion. You help me block Hike Siangchen, or we will all die, think about it. After Otsatsuki Yue said a word, he ignored Otsatsuki Yumura. He knew that Otsatsuki Yumura would make the right choice. Xian for Ming Shenman. Countless red Doria gates fell from the sky and smashed down on Rixiangchen. Otsatsuki Yue did not seek to suppress Rixiangchen, but only wanted to buy a little time. Then Otsatsuki Yue looked serious, and his hands formed a seal to open a space channel which was connected to the pure land. Otsatsuki Yumura looked at Otsatsuki Yu, who had a serious expression and didn't know what to prepare, gritted his teeth, and rushed towards Hikesianchen at the fastest speed. He doesn't want to die, and now he can only trust the methods of his big brother. Otsatsuki Yu, who was concentrating on the seal, also sighed in relief. He was afraid that Otsatsuki Yumura would not listen to him and chose to run away. Then he would have to wait to die. He easily avoided the countless Doria gates that fell from the sky, and then his calf turned into a photon and kicked Otsatsuki Hanamura with a kick at the speed of light. Otsatsuki Hanamura was kicked back, the bones on his chest were broken, leaving a footprint on his chest. Six paths, King Kong blockade. Countless chakra chains flew out from behind Hikesianchen, and went straight to Otsatsuki Hanamura like a dragon. Otsatsuki Yumura immediately dodged and left the place. As soon as Otsatsuki Yumura left, the chakra chain was whipped in his original position leaving many cracks on the ground. Under the pursuit of Hike Siangchen's chains, Otsatsuki Hamura's embarrassed dodge, when it was really impossible to avoid it, he blocked the chains with a black stick of the Taoist Jade in his hand. These chains are extremely hard and are formed by six chakras, and even the black rods made of Kudai or cannot handle these chains. Facing the chakra chains, Otsatsuki Hamura could clearly feel the danger, and he did not dare to be bound by these chains, otherwise who knows what would happen. Come on. I can't hold on anymore. Otsatsuki Yumura shouted at Otsatsuki Yu. There are too many chains, and the speed is very fast. He has been surrounded by these overwhelming chains, and now he can only protect himself by blocking these chains. Otsatsuki Yu didn't answer, didn't he know the critical situation? Of course he knew, but he was at a critical moment now. It's not that Rixianchen's attack didn't target him. But Otsatsuki Yu separated a clone in advance, desperately resisting the chakra chain, buying him time. In the pure land of bliss, there are all the souls who have died within a few hundred years, including the chakras they once cultivated. Why did Yu Otsatsuki set up the ninja sect and pass chakra to the world? Is there really no purpose? Of course not, whether it is Kaguya Otsatsuki or Peach Otsatsuki, they are all very concerned about chakra, and Yu Otsatsuki is no exception. However, compared to the rest of the Otsatsuki clan, Otsatsuki Yu had more ideas, and he didn't bother to do a one-shot deal. He passed on the chakra, as long as the ninja with chakra died, the chakra they cultivated would not disappear but all fell into his hands and collected by him. Otsatsuki Yue treats everyone in the ninja world as sheep, and chakra is wool, so that he can get chakra continuously. I have to say that Otsatsuki Yue is indeed very thoughtful and very successful. In the past seven or eight hundred years, the number of chakras he has collected is amazing, which is much more terrifying than the chakras of the Ten Tails. In fact, Otsatsuki Yue also peeps at Juwai's chakra, but in order to keep a low profile, not to attract the enemy that his mother fears, so Otsatsuki Yue reluctantly separated Juwai's chakra. Otsatsuki Yue originally thought that when his own strength was not afraid of the enemy that his mother feared, he would bring Juwai back. However, the sudden appearance of Rixianchen interrupted his low-key career. He can't keep a low profile any longer, and he'll be killed if he keeps a low profile. Now Otsatsuki Yue desperately wants to get chakra back, and then get back to the scene. Looking at the majestic chakras that are almost endless, Otsatsuki Yue was excited in his heart, and then began to inhale these chakras into his body. At the same time, he looked at the souls in the pure land, and with a ruthless heart, he swallowed all these souls into his body. After the transformation of Otsatsuki Yui, the power of the soul has been turned into a majestic pupil power, which made his withered pupil power become full and stronger than before. After ten minutes, Otsatsuki Yui completely absorbed it, his strength grew like a rocket, and then Otsatsuki Yui returned to the ninja world with confidence. Rixianchen sensed the change of Otsatsuki Yui through the domineering look and couldn't help but put away the chakra chain and looked at Otsatsuki Yui, who had undergone great changes. At this time, Otsatsuki Yui's eyes had turned into Jugu Jade Samsara Shaker, and a blood-red Jugu Jade Samsara Shaker appeared on his forehead. The bewitching Samsara Shunyan looked at Rixianchen, full of murderous aura and greed. If he can get Rixianchen's chakra, plus the ten-tailed chakra, it is the enemy his mother fears, 
and it is definitely not his opponent. If you add Otsatsuki Yui glanced at Otsatsuki Yumura, with even more greed in his heart. Greedy is an original sin, and I can't seem to get rid of it. Like Yui Otsatsuki, Rixiangchen's eyes also glowed with greed. Yui Otsatsuki's thoughts are high Xiangchen's own thoughts, even compared to Yui Otsatsuki, Rixiangchen is more greedy, and his goal is not only the chakra of the ten times six brothers. Both sides stared at each other with greedy eyes, and Otsatsuki Hamura had been ignored by the two. I can give you a chance to surrender. Yu Otsatsuki looked at Rick Siangchen with indifferent A's, feeling the powerful strength of his body, and his confidence all came back. Rick Siangchen raised his eyebrows, so arrogant, he actually made him surrender directly. Since you gave me a chance, then I'm not a stingy person. I'll also give you a chance to dig out your reincarnation writing wheel and then raise your hand to surrender. I can give you a happy death. Otsatsuki Yu is expression turned cold. Since you insist on courting death, then I will fulfill you. Rixianjin waved his hand and pouted his lips in disdain. Don't pretend, you and I both know that I can't let you go, and you won't let me go. Humphrey, Otsatsuki Yu snorted coldly, acquiescing to Rixianjin's words. The momentum of the two rose up, and the ground under their feet continued to crack, and the cracks continued for several kilometers. Poor Otsatsuki Yumura under the attack of this huge momentum, looked very helpless, and could only stare at the two people who were standing in the air with a blank face. How can these two become gods? What does this make him a little god? Chapter 187, The Royal Palace of Heaven In the battle of momentum, Rixianchen easily gained the upper hand, and the invisible momentum was oppressing Yu Otsatsuki. Otsatsuki Yui's face was expressionless, but it was difficult to accept in his heart, why he had absorbed so many chakras, and he was not as good as Rixianchen. The first strike is stronger, Rixianchen instantly appeared behind Otsatsuki Yui, and then slapped it with a palm, wanting to test his strength first. Otsatsuki Yui instantly sensed Rixianchen behind him, and slapped Rixianchen with the palm of his hand. Just when Otsatsuki Yui was wondering how it was so easy to hit Rixianchen, the Rixianchen shot by him turned into a cloud of smoke. At the same time, Yui Otsatsuki felt a sense of crisis, and then he felt a pain in his body. An arm penetrated his body. It seems that you are just like that now. Rixianchen smiled lightly at the corner of his mouth with disdain and mockery in his smile. Otsatsuki Yu ignored the wound on his chest, and Chakra burst out from his body, sending Sun Xiangchen blowing out, and the wound healed at a speed visible to the naked eye. Sun Xiangchen, who was blasted out by the Chakra blowing out of Otsatsuki Yu, just landed next to Otsatsuki Yumura. Rick Xiangchen smiled slightly, stretched out his hand to dig out Otsatsuki Hamamura's eyes like lightning, and then without waiting for Otsatsuki Hamamura to cry out in pain, a light speed kick kicked him on the head. Otsatsuki Yumura was knocked out by this sudden kick, his body was entangled by the divine tree controlled by Rixianchen, and his chakra and vitality were slowly sucked up by the divine tree. Everything was just a blink of an eye, and when Otsatsuki Yumura didn't respond, Haixianchen had already settled Otsatsuki Yumura. Looking at the Otsatsuki Yumura wrapped in the divine tree, Otsatsuki Yumura didn't mean to rescue him, but looked at Rixianchen with a solemn expression. Tanchang Lizun, Otsatsuki Yumura let out a low voice and the breath on his body increased tenfold. Seeing that Otsatsuki Yui's strength has been enhanced tenfold again, Rixianchen's eyes are even more greedy. This pupil technique is too powerful. In Rixianchen's eyes, this pupil technique is more precious than ten tails. Drink! Otsatsuki Yui shouted, and the sixteen sticks smashed towards Rixianchen's head, and the speed and strength were almost the same as Rixianchen. Rixianchen's face became solemn, and he covered his whole body with a domineering look of armament. Then, the strength of his whole body was condensed on his fingers, and he pointed towards Otsatsuki Yui. The powerful force penetrated the space, causing the surrounding space to shatter. Seeing this, Otsatsuki Yui hurriedly retracted the attack, avoiding the blow from Rixianchen. With such a powerful finger, he was not sure what to do next, and at the same time secretly scolded Rixianchen for being perverted. Otsatsuki Yui dares to say that his strength is definitely higher than his mother Otsatsuki Kaguya, even more than a lot, but when facing Rixianchen, he still feels that his strength is somewhat insufficient. Rixianchen smiled disdainfully, his attack is something you can dodge if you want to dodge it. Use space teleportation to appear behind Otsatsuki Yui, and then destroy half of his body with one finger. Otsatsuki Yui hurriedly distanced herself from Haixianchen, and slowly repaired the half of her body that had been beaten to ashes. Rixianchen looked at the flustered Otsatsuki Yui, with a disdainful smile on the corner of his mouth, and looked down on Otsatsuki Yui. In fact, the power of Otsatsuki Yui now is not worse than that of Haixianchen, or even stronger, but unfortunately, Otsatsuki Yui will not use it. To be honest, Otsatsuki Yui's combat experience is not strong. However, it is also understandable that Otsatsuki Yui was of a noble background, and he was not fighting to survive. The only battle he experienced was with his mother, who had extremely poor combat experience. Therefore, Otsatsuki Yui's combat experience is not very good, 
and it is not as good as Hai Xiangchen anyway. And when it comes to various abilities, Rick Xiangchen, who has the system, can crush him. So even if Otsutsuki Yu's strength increases tenfold, Rick Xiangchen is not afraid of him. Even if he can't beat him, Rick Xiangchen still has the immortality and immortality of a dog talisman, and the rogue's pupil technique, Gao Tan Yuan, all grinding can grind him to death. Unlike Rick Xiangchen's relaxed expression, Otsutsuki Yu's expression was not good, as ugly as eating shit. The first attack was not good, and Otsutsuki Yu felt very uncomfortable. I just made a fool of myself and asked me to surrender, so I'm not afraid now. Right? Rick Xianchen teased, Humphrey, with a cold snort, Otsutsuki Yue shot out a golden chakra beam with one palm, very similar to Bagua Mountain Breaking Strike. Looking at the chakra beam, Rick Xianchen naturally wouldn't be stupid enough to take it hard, and immediately escaped into his own space to avoid this blow. Damn, Otsutsuki Yue scolded secretly. When Rick Xianchen came out of the space, he saw Otsutsuki Yue's twisted face. Rick Xianchen grinned at him, full of sarcasm making Yu Otsutsuki's face flush with anger. The Royal Palace of Heaven. Otsutsuki Yu shouted angrily and took Rick Xianchen to the ice space in the Imperial Palace of Heaven. Looking at the endless world of ice and snow, Rick Xianchen did not panic, but looked at it with interest. To die, a loud shout interrupted Rick Xianchen's appreciation of the scenery, and countless ice spears stabbed towards Rick Xianchen. Are you only going to use such little tricks? Rick Xianchen said sarcastically. The ice spear stabbing at him shattered before it approached him. To be honest, I am really surprised that you can use the Imperial Palace of Heaven. This is where your bones are buried. Otsutsuki Yu's face was expressionless, and his voice was extremely cold. Hey Tilda my burial place? You might as well try it. Rick Xianchen's expression became cold, and he looked at Otsutsuki Yu with indifferent A's. He was about to get serious. Chakra Cannon. Otsutsuki Yu roared, and pushed out with both hands, similar to the attack of a tailed beast cannon, sent out in the palm of Otsutsuki Yumura. Rick Xianchen smiled indifferently, stretched out his hand, and faintly spit out two words, destroying God. The powerful chakra cannon, which melted the ice, touched Rick Xianchen's palm, but did not explode 1.4 to emit any power, and was swallowed and absorbed by Rick Xianchen. Otsutsuki Yu's attack can only be said to be a blessing. Not only did it not hurt Rick Xianchen, but it also supplemented Rick Xianchen with chakra. How is that possible? Otsutsuki Yu couldn't believe it. His attack was mixed with the power of the six paths and Sam Sarah couldn't absorb it. How did Rick Xianchen absorb it? Rick Xianchen didn't mean to explain it to him. Taking advantage of Otsutsuki Yui's momentary absence, Rick Xianchen came to him in an instant, put his hand on his back, and used the pupil technique to devour the gods. Otsutsuki Yui's pupils shrank suddenly, and the chakra, vitality and pupil power in his body all poured into Rick Xianchen's body uncontrollably. When Otsutsuki Yui wanted to struggle, countless chakra chains flew out from Rick Xianchen. Tying Otsutsuki Yu. Chapter 188 The Terrified Otsutsuki Yu. Otsutsuki Yu I shouted and shattered the chakra chain with a powerful force. Just when he was about to breathe a sigh of relief, the chakra chain wrapped around again and bound Otsutsuki Yu. Rick Xianchen absorbed chakra behind Otsutsuki Yu and said sarcastic words. You don't have to struggle anymore. You're all about to die anyway. It's better to die more easily than struggling so hard. I'll go to your grandma's leg. Otsutsuki Yu cursed in her heart. Otsutsuki Yu, who was unable to break free was in crisis, and Hai Xianchen's devouring speed was no joke. His current chakra had been swallowed by half. If it is swallowed like this, it will not take long for his chakra to be swallowed up, and then he will only have to take this road. Naturally, Yuotsatsuki was unwilling to die like this. The three Samsara writing wheel eyes fluctuated for a while, and then Yuotsatsuki transferred herself to another dimension, freeing herself from the shackles of Rick Xianchen. Want to run? Not so easy. Rick Xianchen broke through the space and followed the mark left. Chasing the lava space, looking at Yuotsatsuki who was gasping for breath, Xiangchen gave a wicked smile on the 13th, and then kicked Yuotsatsuki's ass, kicking him into the lava. Unprepared, Otsatsuki Yu, who didn't expect Rick Xianchen to follow, suddenly plunged into the magma. After taking a bath in the magma, Otsatsuki Yui flew up, the white robe was torn, and there were several burn marks on his body. However, this can only be said to be a minor injury. At most it will make Otsutsuki Yu embarrassed. Otsutsuki Yu glared at Rick Xianchen fiercely, and then moved the space again and entered the sand space in the Imperial Palace of Heaven. Rick Xianchen also followed in an instant. Rick Xianchen had just entered the sand space, and Otsutsuki Yu, who had been prepared for a long time, set off a sandstorm and swept towards the newly entered Rick Xianchen. There Otsutsuki Yu escaped into another dimension again. Rick Xianchen waved his hand to break up this little trick, and there was a trace of anger in his eyes. He was not in such a good mood and played hide-and-seek with Yuotsatsuki. Back in time, Rick Xianchen spit out four words coldly, Otsatsuki Yu, who had already escaped into other spaces, returned to before he escaped into other spaces, and Rick Xianchen just stood opposite him, 
He clenched his fists and smashed his fist on Otsutsuki Yu's nose, breaking the bridge of his nose. Tears appeared in Otsutsuki Yu's eyes. Rixianchen smiled coldly, everything had just begun. Next, Rixianchen didn't give Otsutsuki Yu'ai time to recover, and punched Otsutsuki Yu'ai in the face. A few big white teeth flew out, and Otsutsuki Yu'ai flew out, leaving a long trail in the desert. Trace. Leaving an afterimage on the spot, Rixianchen appeared on the route that Otsutsuki Yu'ai was flying and slapped Otsutsuki Yu'ai on the face, sending him to the sky. Next, Otsutsuki Yu'ai flew up into the sky, but did not fall, and Rixianchen's fists and feet kept hitting Otsutsuki Yu'ai's face. A face has been beaten into a pig's head. Otsutsuki Yu'ai, who was madly beaten in the face, was a little sluggish and did not know how to resist, as if she had been beaten stupidly. In fact, Otsutsuki Yu is not being beaten stupid now, he is now looking for an opportunity to resist. One hit will kill him. For this opportunity, Otsutsuki Yu'a did not hesitate to be beaten all the time. Otsutsuki Yu'a's eyes were half open and half closed, as if he had lost consciousness. At the moment when Rixi Angchen paused for a moment, Otsutsuki Yu'a's eyes suddenly opened, and his eyes flashed, although it was a bit funny on the pig's face. Otsutsuki Yu'a's left hand has a sun imprint, and a moon imprint appears in his right hand, which is very similar to the shape of the ends of the six tin rods. He came to Rixi Angchen in an instant, put his two hands on Rixi Angchen's body, and shouted, Six paths, Earth Blast Star. This ultimate sealing technique instantly deprives Rixi Angchen of his power, and then a huge gravitational force is generated on Rixi Angchen's body, and the boundless sand and dust below are attracted to it. Soon the dust covered Rixi Angchen, and finally formed an incomparably huge sand ball. Otsutsuki Yue looked at this scene, and laughed loudly in the sky. He finally solved the tricky guy Rixiangchen. Otsutsuki Yue has absolute confidence in his ultimate sealing technique, even his mother could not break the seal. Are you happy that you have solved the enemy? Of course. Otsutsuki Yue's voice stopped abruptly, and turned his head to look at Rixiangchen as if he had seen a ghost. You, aren't you sealed? Are you sure it wasn't my clone that was sealed? Rixiangchen asked back with a smile. Impossible, it's impossible. Otsutsuki Yue roared frantically. After wasting so much energy and taking so many beatings, what was finally sealed was actually a clone. Even Otsutsuki Yue couldn't accept it. When did you use your clone? After a long time, Yue Otsutsuki, who had regained her senses, asked in a dry tone. Actually, it was my clone who hit you in the first place. Didn't you feel the strength? Haixianchen looked at Otsutsuki Yue with a smile. I see. Yue Otsutsuki nodded calmly. He really felt that something was wrong. Before, the strength of Rixianchen was much smaller, but he didn't think much about it because he was eager to win. It's so calm. It seems that I underestimate you. Rixianchen was slightly stunned. I thought Yu Otsutsuki would go crazy with anger, but he seemed to accept it calmly. Is Otsutsuki Yu a calm 767? He was not at all calm, but Otsutsuki Yu forcibly suppressed the impulse in his heart. After knowing that he could not defeat Haixianchen with strength, Otsutsuki Yu was going to rely on a strategy to defeat Haixianchen, so he had to keep calm. After thinking for a long time, Otsutsuki Yu sadly discovered that in the face of absolute strength, all conspiracies and tricks are useless. In the end, Yuo Satsuki was ruthless in his heart, and controlled the supergiant sand ball in the sky to smash it down. Although it is made of sand, this sand ball has a higher density and a huge volume. If it falls, the entire sand space will be destroyed. Looking at the rapidly falling sand ball, Rixianchen chuckled lightly, bending his legs slightly, and pulling his arms into an exaggerated posture. Physique Profound Truth, Star Death Strike The Crimson Chakra Flames burned, forming a crimson dragon. The space distorted and oscillated, and Rixianchen hit the falling sand planet. The huge sand ball that fell was smashed into ashes by this blow. The space cracked a huge hole, and the dragon drilled into the space crack and disappeared. Rixianchen's blow made Otsutsuki Yu extremely horrified. If this blow hit him, would he be able to withstand it? The answer is absolutely unbearable, that blow may turn him into ashes, and the gust of wind set off by the star death strike left several deep wounds on his body, not to mention being hit in the front. Chapter 189 Solve the Otsutsuki Yu. Lost? I think you don't want to live anymore. Rixianchen smiled coldly. At this time, Otsutsuki Yu actually dared to be stunned. Xiantha Spiral Flash Shuriken. The highly compressed golden light formed the shape of a shuriken. The sharp blade could cut through everything, and Hai Xianchen hurled it towards Otsutsuki Yu. The spiral flashing shuriken slashed towards Otsutsuki Yu at the speed of light, and the target was his head. Facing this swift spiral flashing shuriken, the sense of crisis in Otsutsuki Yu's heart made him subconsciously avoid the key points. The spiral flashing shuriken did not hit Yuot Satsuki's head, but slashed across his body, cutting him into two pieces. Seeing this scene, Rixianchen shook his head regretfully. If he was hit in the head, it would definitely kill him. But if it hits the body, it is useless for Otsatsuki Yu. As long as he doesn't get hit in the head, even if you destroy his entire body, 
he can still recover. It's even more powerful than Xu's super speed regeneration, almost immortal. Rixianchen doesn't know if this is exclusive to the sixth path. Anyway, both Otsatsugi Yuya and Otsatsugi Yumora can do it. As for Rixianchen himself, the ability to devour the dog talisman is immortal. I have to say, this resilience is a bit rascal. Rixianchen shook his head, looking at Otsatsuki Yuya with a cold expression. His eyes were extremely dull. Earth blast. Fifty black spheres flew out of Otsatsuki Yuya's hand, and the gravitational force exploded frantically. Old tricks, useless. Rixianchen shook his head gently. Otsatsuki Yuya was now exhausted, and now he was just struggling to the death. Rixianchen used eight foot Kyungu Jade, countless light bullets with extremely strong penetrating power. To remove all fifty black in the sky. Otsatsuki Yuai watched this scene and was not surprised. He knew that the Earth Burst Star was useless to Rixianchen, but he still used it. Could it be some kind of conspiracy? Of course not, he is now struggling to the death. All the cards in his hand have been used up, and Otsatsuki Yuai has completely lost his move. But Otsatsuki Yuai didn't want to be caught without his hands. Seeing Rixianchen using the eight foot Kyungu Jade, Otsatsuki Yuai gathered all his strength and chakra and punched him. Rixianchen smiled coldly. His arms covered his arms with a domineering look, and the chakra in his body boiled. Boiled escape, unparalleled unparalleled power. The two fists slammed together, setting off an endless sandstorm, and the two figures were thrown out at the same time. Rixianchen stood in the air, looking at Yuotsatsuki on the opposite side, and the two were on a par with this blow. Yuotsatsuki was startled, and now he realizes that his strength is not weaker than that of Sun Xianchen, and the confidence in Yuotsatsuki's heart has risen again. Rixianchen could clearly see the light of hope in Otsatsuki Yu's eyes, and shook his head gently. Using martial arts as a metaphor, Otsatsuki Yu has super internal power, but there is no move that can exert super internal power. And Rixianchen is not only not weaker than his internal strength, but also has countless super powerful moves. Therefore, even though the strength of the two is not much different, the combat effectiveness is vastly different. Xian for lava pillar, Otsatsuki Yu shouted loudly and a fiery column of magma spewed out of his mouth. Reaching out his hand to block in front of him, Rixianchen said lightly, I have Samsara, devouring god. The extremely powerful magma was swallowed and absorbed by Rixianchen's reincarnation eye pupil technique. What? Even the six paths immortal techniques can be absorbed. Otsatsuki Yua was extremely horrified, and the confidence that had just risen was completely beaten. It's time to end. Hixianchen's voice came from behind Otsatsuki Yua. What? Otsatsuki Yua's pupils shrank suddenly feeling like a thorn in his back. Six Dao, eight diagrams, 361 forms. The entire space was shrouded in the yin-yang gossip array. In the gossip array, Otsatsuki Yuai was bound by the power of the six paths of yin and yang, and he couldn't even move a finger. Rixianchen's left hand flashes with the mark of the sun, and the right hand flashes with the mark of the moon, representing the yin and yang poles. The hands left countless light and shadows, and in less than a second, the 361 palms were completely completed. Otsatsuki Yuai's body acupuncture points were all sealed, with a roar from his body, and then fell to the ground. Rixianchen looked at Otsatsuki Yuai, who was lying on the ground, unable to speak, and the boiling chakra on his body also calmed down. This move, six paths and eight trigrams 361, is both a physical technique and a sealing technique. It was created by Rixianchen on a whim when he saw Otsatsuki Yuai using six paths and earth blast stars. The effect also made Rixianchen very satisfied. He was as strong as Otsatsuki Yu under this set of palm techniques. He was also deprived of all his strength and fell to the ground unable to move. Otsatsuki Yu stared at Rixianchen with three eyes, and now he can move a little except his eyes, but he can't move at all. Yo are you still dare to stare at me? You are very kind, watch me dig out your eyes. Rixianchen had a malicious smile on his face. Tancheng Lizen is a powerful technique, you don't deserve it at all and only the powerful me can have this pupil technique, ha ha ha. Rixianchen laughed wildly. Otsatsuki Yue looked at Rixianchen with hatred eyes, if he still had the power, he would definitely destroy his eyes, and even if he did, he wouldn't let this guy who he hated so much get them. Facing Otsatsuki Yue's hateful gaze, Rixianchen smiled slightly, then stripped him of his hateful gaze, reaching out and digging out his three samsara shakers. Then Rixianchen grabbed Otsatsuki Yuya and left the space in the Imperial Palace of Heaven. Looking at the tall divine tree that touched the sky, Hixianchen threw the Otsatsuki Yuya with all the sealed power at the divine tree. The branches of a divine tree immediately wrapped Otsatsuki Yuya, absorbing his chakra and vitality. Actually, the divine tree is a cancer to the earth, a cancer that constantly plunders the earth's energy, Rixianchen said softly. Glancing at the tree, Rixianchen entered the system space, and let the divine tree devour their chakra. After the sucking is done. Rixianchen devours the chakra of the divine tree again. In the system space, Xia was teaching Sarah to refine chakra, 
and the relationship between the two women was much better. After staying in the system space for a few days, Rick Xianchen left the system space and saw the huge fruit at the top of the divine tree as soon as he came out. As the divine tree bare fruit, Rick Xianchen smiled slightly, then flew to the top of the divine tree and looked at the fruit. He could feel the enormous energy in it. The people who were bound by the divine tree did not turn into something like Bei Ige. Under the control of Rixi Angjin, the divine tree absorbed all the energy in their bodies, including the two brothers Lu Dao, all turned into mummified corpses. Chapter 190 Destroy the World Would you like to eat it? Rixi Angjin stretched out his hand and poked the fruit of the divine tree, and said to himself, Forget it, let's just devour it directly. The effect is the same anyway. Rick Xianchen thought about it and didn't plan to eat the fruit of the divine tree directly, because Rick Xianchen is afraid of what will happen after eating, such as opening the third eye on the forehead, or growing the horns of the Otsutsuki clan. Rick Xianchen is very satisfied with his current appearance, and does not want to become a mess. And his swallowing is different, as long as it is an item swallowed by Rick Xianchen, it can be integrated into the body according to Rick Xianchen's wishes, and there will be no changes beyond Rick Xianchen's control reach out to pick the fruit of the tree of gods, and then use the eye of reincarnation devourer to devour the chakwin life energy in it frantically. A few minutes later, after completely devouring the energy of the fruit of the divine tree, Rick Xianchen stood up and moved his muscles and bones, causing the air to burst. Whether it is pupil strength, chakra, and physical strength, they have all increased a lot. Rick Xianchen estimated that after swallowing the fruit of the divine tree, Rick Xianchen's strength nearly doubled. Although doubling it doesn't seem like much, but Hai Xianchen was already terrifyingly strong before, and Hai Xianchen was able to double it because of the chakra collected by Otsatsuki Yu over the past 700 years. After swallowing the fruit of the tree, Rick Xianchen took out the three nine hooked jade reincarnation writing wheel eyes of Otsatsuki Yu and then swallowed its energy 963. In a moment, the three reincarnation writing wheel eyes turned into powder, Rick Xianchen's eyes changed into nine hook jade reincarnation writing wheel eyes, the strange red light flashed for a moment and then changed into the appearance of reincarnation eyes again. At this time, Rick Xianchen's reincarnation eye has also become Jugo's reincarnation writing reincarnation eye, Tan Chang Li Zun. Rick Xianchen shouted lowly, the momentum on his body suddenly increased tenfold, and the divine tree made an overwhelmed sound because of Rick Xianchen's sudden burst of momentum. Rick Xianchen looked at the earth under his feet, and he had a feeling in his heart that he could blow up the earth with one punch. However, this is completely a psychological illusion caused by too much increase in strength. Rick Xianchen's current strength is not enough to destroy Earth King. It is very easy to blow up the moon in the sky, because the moon is hollow, even if you don't use Tan Cheng Lizen, Rick Xianchen can also shatter the moon. Release the technique of Tan Cheng Lizen, and then Rick Xianchen looked at the divine tree. The fruit of the divine tree is just a side dish in Hai Xianchen's plan. The real goal of Hai Xianchen is not the power of the ten tail divine tree but the power to plunder the entire world. The divine tree grows with the natural energy of the world. How big is the natural energy of the world? Standing at the top of the divine tree, Rick Xianchen used Samsara I, devouring God, using the divine tree as a bridge to devour the energy of the entire world. Devouring the energy of the entire world cannot be accomplished overnight. Even if Rick Xianchen's devouring speed is very fast, it will take a long time. This Rick Xianchen is also prepared. In a blink of an eye, three months have passed and the whole world has changed a lot. Looking at any corner of the world, no life exists. Whether it was the tenacious weeds or the most numerous insects, all disappeared. Even the towering tree of the god tree has fallen down now, its leaves are withered, and its branches will break if it is blown by the wind, and there is no vitality at all. The appearance of the divine tree also represents other corners of the world, and the whole world is dead silent. You are really cruel. Xuj's words came to Rick Xianchen's mind. If you don't do it for yourself, the world will be destroyed. What's the harm in destroying a world that has nothing to do with me? Rick Xianchen said softly. To destroy the vitality of the world, he does not have the slightest psychological burden. Perhaps this has something to do with his natural character. He's naturally very indifferent to things he doesn't care about. The creatures of this world are dispensable things to him. Anyway, he doesn't care about them. If he can strengthen his strength by destroying them, of course Rick Xianchen will do it. In fact, you don't understand my painstaking efforts. I'm doing this for peace. You see now, there is no more fighting. The whole world is very peaceful. Rick Xianchen put on a noble look. Fuck you, you think I don't know you. Xuj, who was in the system space, rolled her eyes. I'm not here to cleanse my sins, to destroy a world, what a sin. If I don't add a good reputation, it doesn't mean that I am a sinner. Rick Xianchen said earnestly. Xuj was speechless. Could it be that this will erase the sins you have committed? After hundreds of millions of years, when the world is reborn as human beings, I hope they will not forget me, the founder of peace. No. I'm going to set up a monument to let the future human beings know my greatness. Rick Xianchen stretched out his hand and waved, and a huge stone tablet rose up, with the words the founder of world peace, Rick Xianchen. Looking at this stone tablet, 
Rixianchen nodded in satisfaction. After staying in this world for so long, it's time to leave. Rixianchen's eyes turned to the only place in the world where there was still an energy response. There is the dragon vein, which is also deliberately preserved by Rixianchen. Looking up at the moon, there seemed to be people from the Otsutsugi clan on the moon. Everything in Vientiane, it's all ashes. The residual fire is two sword. Rixianchen took out the flowing blade like fire, opened the solution. The fiery breath enveloped the whole world, and the originally dead earth cracked countless holes in an instant. Just a few days ago, Rixianchen finally opened the swastika, completely grasping the power of the fire. Remnant fire sword, north, ashes of heaven and earth. Rixianchen suddenly swung the knife in the direction of the moon. In a moment, the moon disappeared, wiped out by the tang of the core temperature of the sun's core. After releasing the Evolution Liu Ohu O, Rixianchen walked towards the dragon veins. Soon came to the location of the dragon vein, Rixianchen waved his hand to open the dragon vein. The chakra of the dragon vein instantly wrapped Rixianchen and Rixianchen did not resist. Just as Rixianchen was about to leave this world, his eyes slammed into outer space, and a smile appeared on the corner of his mouth. Tanchang Lizun, Super Vientian Tanyan. In an instant, the three guys were pulled over by Rixianchen, and then, together with Rixianchen, were teleported to his original world. Standing in the place before being teleported, Rixianchen took a deep breath. Looking at the restless dragon vein chakra, Rixianchen stretched out his hand to swallow the dragon vein chakra, and there is no dragon vein since then. But the huge chakra of the dragon vein has little strength for Rixianchen. At this time, Rixianchen looked at the three fainted guys under his feet. These are three guys of the famous Otsatsugi trio, people that even Kaguya Otsatsugi, the ancestor of chakra, is afraid of. However, he was already slapped by Rixianchen with one slap. Absorbing the power of the whole world, Rixianchen's strength has surpassed the sixth Tao level, and he used Han Chen Lizen to increase his strength tenfold. With a single slap, he slapped three of their awesome characters fainted. It can only be said that they are unlucky. If they appear one second later, Rixianchen will be sent back by Dragon Vein Chakra, and it can only be said that their luck is not good. How to deal with these three guys? Rixianchen looked at the three guys at his feet and didn't know what to do with them. He just grabbed them subconsciously before, and never thought about how to deal with them. Let's kill it first. The provincial one wakes up and makes a fuss. Rixianchen shot three kunai formed by Yin and Yang from his hand, piercing the three of them's heads. If you like this audiobook, Subscribe the channel for more videos like this. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook. I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.